nephew. He alright, he's a good boy. He's a grown boy. He's that's alright, that's my nephew. What's going on YouTube? It's Kevin and Mikkel. We are back with a new video for you guys. We're here to talk about tonight's episode of Match Made in Heaven, which is the second episode. If you missed the first episode, you can watch the video exclusively on our, well not exclusively, but you can watch it on our channel. That's where we want you to watch it at. Exclusive. Right on the home page. Exclusively. On the Scorpion <laughs> Show. Just like we exclusively had Beyonce's <laughs> I Was Here video. Okay, we sure did. But, but I had to take I it mean, off. Yeah, but we didn't have it. Ha I mean, we had it. was we sent to it. us. It was sent yeah. to us. Yeah. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so, Boy TV sent it to us for right. y'all to watch. <laughs> so, we hope that you watched that first episode. And I hope that you watched tonight's episode of Match Made in Heaven. Because let me tell you something. The Blonde Taraj, oh, they gave me my <laughs> life. On this episode, okay. and one of them had the nerve to be from Philly. Well, she's not really from Philly. Technically. She's from Bucks County. Bucks County, yeah. She could but stay. She kept repping Philly. Yes, yeah, she could stay in Bucks County. That'd be Jamie, County. James. I'm just saying. That's what they were calling. That's what they were calling. She was drunk. Oh, fucking shit. <laughs> so. Yeah, so if you don't know what Match Made in Heaven is about, she was on. Yes, she was on. Batch, batch, match. match Made in Heaven is a, uh, about a bachelor from Philadelphia, Sean Ballard, who was looking to find his match. So there's 24 women in one house, and they have the pastor, who is the spiritual advisor to Sean, to Sean, helping him select the right woman to be the perfect match for him. And I mean, these girls. You know, it's only one man that they're vying for. So you got all of these girls in that house. Some of them trying to be friends. Some of them, I'm not going to be your friend. I'm not I'm not going there. Blah, blah, blah. It's all about me. One girl, her edges was messed up. They going in. These girls, you know, they got to they gotta fill each other out. And, you know, I'm loving it so far. I'm loving it so far. I think that. I don't, I don't want Ness to win, but I think that's just her strategy to act like she's a virgin. But she's there to well, she's scope out well, no, no, no. girls. Remember Ness? Well, yeah, she's definitely there to scope out <laughs> the other girls. <laughs> but remember, she said she's a virgin in the sense that she's never had sex with a man. Yeah. But she's been sexual with a woman. Of course, some people will say, well, well how can you tell you ain't no damn virgin? Because right, no, you have. Well, well, hey, I mean, it is what it is. <laughs> I mean, we can go on and on about that. <laughs> okay. That's a video on the phone. But. She said that she is a virgin and she's never had sex with a man. So I guess technically she is a virgin. Um, she's a very pretty girl. I, I think her and Sean would make a really nice looking couple. She's very beautiful. He's a nice looking guy. I might add the first African American male bachelor on television. Mm -hmm. Hello? Like that is a win win right there. And he's from Philly. That's a triple win for us because mm -hmm. we're from Philly. And you're able to look for him if you Philly is getting more popular on like TV now. And he has money. That's a millions of dollars. That's a, what's triple? What's that the triple? Quadruple? Quadruple. <laughs> quadruple. Get your numbers together. <laughs> Get all of your numbers together. A quadruple winner. Yes, okay. Let me tell you something, okay? I have to, have to pay all this money today. Yes. Okay, okay yeah, That's we heard about <laughs> yes. we heard about that situation. So all my money is all my numbers is messed up right now. <laughs> <laughs> I, mean, I still got something in my bank account. <laughs> All right, I'm just bail. Yeah. But yes, like shout out to him. Like he is doing the damn thing. Sean is really doing the damn thing. And I looked him up the other day when We TV had hit us up um, about promoting the show, and I wanted to learn a little bit more about Sean. And like he's really, really a smart guy, and he really knows his stuff when it comes to real estate and just buildings. In particular, like he really knows what mm -hmm. he's doing, and that's why he's so successful. And I love when he went on that date and he told Mecca, you know, she asked him what was that first big moment for him, and he was saying how he, you know, when he got his first million dollars, he mm -hmm. actually cried. And I was like, child, I remember when I got my first ten dollars, I cried for damn yes. self, okay? Like, but that was like a big moment for him, and I can imagine with anybody, especially a black man, mm -hmm. to be that successful. I, I think anybody would have cried, whether you're black or white. But I mean, it just was so good to see a black man in a positive light. Now, of course, he got a lot of ratchets vying for his love. Yes, but, but you know what? I, I like some of the girls. I like. I do too. I just I can't. Them. It's hard to remember their names though, because yeah. it's too many. It's too girls. many. It really it's is too many. many of them. I could have even like twelve <laughs> girls. It's just too many. It they is too all. Many. So I know one looks like Kelly Rowland, one looks like Rudy Huxtable, um, 
Mecca just need her edges done. Really, she really need them done. Um, I like one of the girls she from just Texas. Need them faded out. That's all. It, it it's just bad. big. But but he see he was just kicking all that game and I'm yeah. like she is not even all that like yeah. she she don't know how to talk them panties off too. Yeah, be quiet, Mikael. And boxes. Oh, um, you know how to your boxes. I don't wear boxes. First of all, boxes are so 2006. Mm. I don't wear those. It's if y'all could just be here with him, <laughs> just watching this damn show. Who? <laughs> with you. Why? What was I doing? What was I doing? I think I was... Uh, no, I'm not <laughs> going. I mean, Sean, I mean, yeah. <laughs> and I just hope he finds the right woman. Because he seems like a very intelligent, smart mm -hmm. guy. And I would hope, I would, not hope, but I would hate for him to pick the wrong person, you know. I've seen a lot of ratchets. I've seen a, a lot of unnecessary stuff with the females. Mm -hmm. And as I'm watching, I'm like, these girls ain't really the right one for this particular guy. Like, yeah. this guy got so much going for him, and he's attractive, and he's smart, and he's he's just intelligent, and he's attractive, mm -hmm. and he's, you know, attractive, and so he just has so attractive, and he just has so much attractive, and he just has so much, <laughs> he just has so much going for him. Like, I want him to spend a little bit more time with these girls, because I'm tired of the, uh, it was the spiritual advisor. Yeah. No, I, I see wanna, too, you see too much of yeah, him. Yeah, like yeah. he spends more time with the girls than Sean. Than Sean. And I want to see Sean dealing more time with the, the girls, especially on the next episode, mm -hmm. because the mother is coming. Da, 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 da. And like she said, I will fuck a bitch up if they break my son's heart, okay? And I like that. I like that kind of. Moms like that, they the ones you like to be around because they don't hold nothing back. They keep talking and. She's going to be telling him who to get rid of and everything. I have to see that. But something that another thing that I like about this show is that they use the little cell phones or the iPhones to let you know we're a match. You can stay. And we need to talk. Or we need to talk. <laughs> <laughs> or, or, you got, or, or we're not a match. You got to go. Yeah. Pack your bags. Time to say. So go ahead and get them gone. <laughs> so... The elimination t tonight, you know, I knew that the blind the blind Taraj was going to go, but I didn't know that they were like that much emotionally attached to each other. Right. Because when she was like, he's the girl was like, I love you. She he was like, me. I love you more than he even go obviously. So he he told mm -hmm. Jamie, you got to go. I don't yeah. even like yeah. that was a big bye girl, fly girl. You got mm -hmm. to go. And then. What's, what's that? Um, Jamie? Jamie? Jamie was the one with the pink that yeah. he eliminated. And then her girlfriend, Victoria, Victoria said, she did. well, well, I don't want to stay here if Jamie's not going to be here anymore. But you're not here for Jamie. No. You're here for Sean. And, you know, and what really shocked me is when she said that in Sean's response. Oh, I, but I really want you to stay. Why? <laughs> she just told you she didn't want to stay. Well, I, not, I, I didn't even see a connection with them. Me I neither. I, don't I didn't know it. what Sean, I, I don't know if Sean was just being nice, but I didn't see what the hell he saw in her. Because, mm -mm. to truth be told, I thought her and Jamie was, you know. Stumble and bumble, all they did was drink the whole damn episode. Stumble and, and, and bumble, yeah. Stumble I thought they was bumble. rubbing a little carpet and something <laughs> together. And then she had about body. Yeah, I said, what's going on with them? They pushing each other over and doing like this and <laughs> grabbing each other and they're getting drunk together. And the other one, they got no drawers on and this is going on. It was a whole lot going on. Yeah. But, you know. Um, I I don't know. Stumble and bumble. <laughs> Stumble and bumble. Yes. I I want I want to see more, and I also want to see more the the cattiness with the girls too, cause it like. You didn't get enough for that. No, I didn't get enough. <laughs> no, I did not. No, I want more because like, cause when the girls, like I think he, but but the show's already taped. But I want him to do do something to the girls like, for those that don't get picked on the date. You got to clean the house, or you got to do this, you got to do that, so I can see the girls go at it. Because they all just so jealous, and they all mad because mm -hmm. they didn't get picked on a date. So they going, of course, it's natural to hate on the one that yeah, yeah. that's it. But they all in the house, I want to see them go to work, do something. Besides just hate on that one person it that gives got me, the date. They kind of give me a good version of Bad Girls Club. It's different they're for not, me. They're not really going at it the way Bad Girls Club would, but I mean... I guess Flavor of Love, batch, the Bachelor version of Flavor of Love, to me. Yeah. Batch, the Bachelor Flavor With of Love. With a better looking Way, way better. <laughs> okay. Way better. I don't know how to be quiet, Nicole. And then the mom is more feisty than uh, Flav's mom. 
So play like, mom wasn't on there like that. I know, but she was, you know, she was on there. She was a sweetheart. Rest, may she rest. She peace. passed away. Old. Yeah. So, so yeah, this is our recap for Match Made in Heaven. Make sure y'all watch that video, our review of the video next week. If you missed tonight's episode, I'm sure you can go over to WeTV.com and check it out. Or you could go to their channel, check your local listings. Or if we get the video, we'll post it on that channel and you can watch it. But it comes Exclusively. on. Exclusively. 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 On the Scorpion <laughs> Show. But every Wednesday night at 8 p.m., make sure you guys check yes, it out. Yes, make sure y'all watch it because we're going to talk about it again next week. Okay. So we'll see y'all next week. Peace.